Hey, Sam from 3D here. In this short video, I will show you what is inside Premium Fonts 3D library. So let's take a look inside. I downloaded the, the fonts and what we can see is tutorials. Tutorials are for beginners. We are talking about the basics, how to use the Blender and how to squeeze our 3D libraries. The license, basically it's the same for every our 3D library. You can use our fonts and other libraries on personal and commercial use. You just can't resell PNG files or or vendor files for example or merchandise t-shirts in board games in marketplaces or photo banks and so on still you can contact me if you have any question regarding the license or some custom licensing then we have like free version basically there are png files of 8 different 3d fonts like for example fluffy one you can see that every letter is rendered isolated in png file with transparent background so you can just grab it in figma photoshop or any other tool and you can just use it then you have source files every font here is the preview of the whole font for example the fluffy one as you can see it consists of uppercases lowercases numbers and special characters okay so then we have the premium and in the premium the structure is the same for example balloon as you can see we have the balloon font or i will show you for example the cyber font so this is how it looks like like every font is generated high res and this is as you can see it's highly detailed this is why it's premium and you can see the small things if i scroll and this is what, what is every letter is rendered isolated so as you can see here you can go to blender and change the colors easily and play with the font i will show you for example flora also because the details are here are insane and they work pretty nicely also on some posters or maybe some social on social media and so on so this is how it looks like and you can customize basically how it is rendered you can put some randomness inside change the colors of leaves change the colors on branches and so on let me show you design font for example the same thing apply here you can see that again like it's all png files which you can reuse or you can use the source file let me show you also the candy uh, look how detailed it is it's really like 3D look and it can't be done in 2D program, for example, in Adobe because it's really hard to fake all of these things and to change it based on your needs, right? So this is how it looks like. And it's pretty cool and pretty easy to use. Okay, so this is it. I will show you also, for example, the source files of Christmas font. So here we are in the Blender file of Christmas font. As you can see that you have like the whole font inside which you can reuse and you can easily change the colors. For example, I'm just changing this color to something else and this is how you can easily customize it. Then we bring like the, the font thanks to which you can easily write inside the Blender. So for example, I will write test and I want to use balloon 3D font. So this is, I chose it, I click generate and voila, I have like balloon test in test. Then I can grab it, I can click font adjustment and I can easily align it. I can use different axes or I can align it by different parts. The other cool thing is that you can prepare your own font. If you have, for example, some font inside the blender you can just prepare it here will be the your font name and then you can just add the font inside the tool in the add-on then you can also delete the font anyone you want to so it's easy to manage and easy to use the add-on and thanks to that you can create for example this or combine with our 3d characters or you can do this or this this and so on and so forth. So that was it. Thank you for watching. If you want to learn more about the fonts, go to fonts.design. If you have any question regarding Blender or anything else, reach out to me at samuel at 3d.design. If you want to learn more about our 3D libraries, go to 3d.design. And if you want to see what we are building, go to our Discord server and, and be around like-minded people, designers who want to use 3D wisely. That's it. Thank you so much. Have a great day and stay creative. Bye.